my channel. I am Naturally Carlissa, and today I'm gonna be doing a wash go, wash and go, using TGIN's new rose water soothing leave-in conditioner and their curl defining styling gel. So I've never used TGIN before. Um, I wanted to try it out because they have a brand new line with their brand. So this will be my first time trying TGIN. Also, I wanted to add a little color, so I have a ORS curls. I have the ORS curls unleashed um in the color bombshell so this is my first time trying that too so this is a this is a video first if you like this video like and subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram at naturally underscore calissa i have a lot more content on there so i've heard many good things about tgin all good things all good things i watched too much frozen so i'm gonna do this the way that i used to do when i take uh small sections and define each curl and then I'm gonna diffuse so that I can get this done quickly I'm gonna put the leave-in on all of this and I opened it to smell it so that's what it looks like it smells good it smells like sweet pea and I'm gonna go back through with my brush with the best and detangle and then I'm going to define and clump my curls with my diamond brush. Okay, so far I like the slip. All right, so I'm going to separate this into two sections. And I'm going to take this gel. So the gel, I thought it was pink, the bottle's pink, it's white. I'm gonna take that much gel, probably too much. And I'm just going to put this all through my hair. So I think I put too much gel on. So you don't need as much product as I just put on. They're definitely clumped. I'm just gonna leave them like that. And I want y'all to excuse me. This light is so bright, I can barely see what I'm doing. So, sorry. I think I go through with the color. Now it's open, but I only opened it because I wanted to see what it looked like. So that's the goal. It's gonna be all openly back. I can't really see it. Maybe it's there. I don't know. It'll be some type of highlight. I can't see it. I'm gonna show y'all the back. Don't worry if there's color all in splotchy places. I went through and I just rubbed, so I probably shouldn't have done that, but I don't know what it looks like yet. I really don't. This side always has the least amount of definition, which is why I always put it back. So I'm going to try to do some shingling on this side. Well, mostly towards the front. Okay, I'm gonna finish this side and then we'll get to diffusing. So I am all finished with all of this. I'm about to go diffuse. And then after I go diffuse, there is a bright piece of something back there that I just saw. Uh, I'm just going to leave it. I don't care. All right. So this is my whole head. I don't know if you guys can see that. I say that every time. No one you can't. 
I'm gonna go to the fuse and then I'll come back with my final results on everything. All right, so my hair is like 90% dry. I did, I went back through and diffused my hair and separated some curls. Um, I can't really see the color. Maybe when I go outside, I'll see it. But this is my final results. As far as the leave-in from TGIN and the gel, I love them. They define my curls um, to no avail. And as far as this color, I don't know. I don't know. I'll probably stick with my Gemini Naturals. But I am definitely feeling all the curl, the curl, the curlage, if that's a word. I, I'm still trying to learn how to make my hair big. Like, I want big hair and I don't know how to do it. So that's something that, that's one of my goals to work on. This is a great first step for you know, trying a new brand that everybody's been talking about. I can't wait to try some of their twisting creams and stuff. Have you guys tried TGIN? What do you think about them? I like this collection. That's all I got, people. I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.